Hello people and welcome back to Speed and Size Epic Adventure. Alright. It helps us start stop what the time the kitchen timer. Okay. Right where we left off, we just finished two oh, my phone's been a bit loose. We just finished Anyway. Just finished two level two one. And see, you've got an extra life having more than 100 trees. I've had that a couple of times after looking back at the video. Alright, let's continue on with 2 2. Good, and then the controls. I'm going to save E for a moment. Hit boom wing here. And obviously, put a boost there to help us get back here quicker. I also noticed that the sound was just a little bit low, so I'll turn it up a little bit like that. Ooh. Well, so far so good in this second part. <laughs> More boom rings. I know in the third level there will be a new weapon. Oh gosh. There will be a new weapon, so um, not sure about level 2. I think it's just boom rings and cheese balls in level 2. But anyway, we'll move on. More about that when we actually come up to it. Oof, I might have always going to not make it. I've never made it up the top right there, so I don't know what that is. I think it's cheese balls. No, it's a heart. I'm getting bold with my predictions here. When we get up to well three, uh gee no cheese balls. When we get up to well three, it's going to be interesting. This game does get harder, but it's not as ridiculously hard as little well four. Well four's gonna be a nightmare. Well five I'm looking forward to doing, so that's my favourite world. World six, well ow. I think that's the end of the second level. Yes. Right, two three now. Yeah, points you down the right way to go. Left if you do go down the right one you can only land that little platform so you'd better pray to. <laughs> I don't think there's anything beyond that, I think it's just except for as Kiko would be Death Okay, I can't do Kiko's voice. Yeah, that's maybe English but I can't do his voice. No, no, this is what I mean. If, you, if you've got one weapon and there's a new weapon, yeah, you lose the old weapon and gain a new one. I don't want boom rings, but I prefer cheese balls, so I'm keep the cheese balls. Glad the video came out okay, except for it being just a little bit quiet. But I'll put the video up probably much slightly this time, so hopefully that's fixed. Oh sugar. Come on, normally we have no problem with this bit on Game Boy. That's better. Right, you can go down for a couple of cheese. Only as far as there. Otherwise you get killed. Ah, now is this room with a new weapon in it? Couple of cheese bits here. I think this room's got a new weapon in it, if I remember. On the right here. Now, if I remember, this is bombs. It is! New weapon. Bombs is more damage than boomerang and cheese balls. That's how it's used. 
but it can sometimes be a bit hard to throw at enemies. But being a bit of an expert at this game, it's not so hard for me. As it does more damage than the recent cheese balls. Not my favourite weapon. It's not the most powerful, there is a weapon more powerful than it. But it's one of the most powerful weapons. Now, there are two more weapons in the game. One, I think we'll see in the next world. One, keep my bombs, not the cheese balls, so I'll pick up the cheese balls. And the other one, we won't see until the final level of the game. So that weapon's only found in the final weapon of the game, it's quite a shame. It's the most, that weapon's the most powerfulest. To try and keep the game with some difficulty at least. I'm not complaining too much. And here we go, I think we're up to boss now. Yep, boss! In this boss you get the cheese balls. And you're up against a Jaguar that can turn invisible. So turn invisible, he can still hurt, hit you while he's invisible. Can you hit him when he's visible? When he's visible, he'll either do like a run, increase the bone dash, or he'll jump. At most, just doing the running dash. I might still best you've got to get rid of all his health. I think he tends to jump when he's low on health. Ooh! No, he's just sticking to speed boost for a moment. Yeah, now he's jumping. There you go, now he's going to jump. Ow. Can still hit you while he's invisible. Oh! There you go, got him. That's the next mouse rescued. And that's World 2 done. Now, World 3, I think that's Wind Country, if I remember. Yep. World 3. That's it, where you give us boom range. But those side blocks can only be broken if you speed boosting them through them. You can't move when you hop on a leaf, but you can, but you can still shoot. Tornadoes take quite a few hits to kill, but not in, even with bombs though. Don't be surprised if a bit of trouble for you. Peppy the Poor, I think it's called, or is it just normal skunk? You can take quite a few hits to kill, even two with bombs. And you just maybe just jumps around trying to home in on you. Get the site up here, remember? Yes, one up. Okay. These bots can only be destroyed by fire inside here. I think it's boom range, so just in case. No, it's heart again. Don't want to break down there, otherwise you should fall down to your death. I'm awesome. Oh, it would help them. Jumped! Don't have cheese. Oh, maybe I have to go down that way. Okay, and maybe I have to go down this way then. Uh, make a bigger hole. That's better. Oh, maybe it's not, not dead down here. Oh, sugar. Lost my bombs. Yeah. No, I'm <laughs> so now I've got to have to make do with cheese balls now. Right. Can you move in? Oh. Lost my cheese balls now. Cheese balls and boom, his cheese balls got longer range. 
Ooh. Things that uh, tornadoes do fire out can be can be shot to move them. Hmm. Uh, nothing up there, no. The pattern's too high up, can't jump it. We come. I think I'll end the video when I get to the end of this level. Why not? Maybe we'll need these one ups for the next world. At least on the boss anyway, the boss bloody on World 4. Didn't jump players, I think it's something on the top right. There we go. I might hop up now, back up now. Yeah, we can hop up back here. Um, we could have. I can jump down here if I want. Maybe he can go down there, but never mind. And that's it. Okay, and then call it that video. When we come back, I'll finish off World 3 and possibly make a start to World 4. So, I hope you're enjoying this XP, although no one's watched on YouTube by the time this is recording. That's not normal in most of my videos, especially the new ones, so I'm not complaining. Anyway, if anyone does watch this, I'll see you when I come back. Bye-bye.